Hi everyone, Free Peas Afterlife contact. It's very chilly up here, guys. Cold. Yeah, it's, it it's, brisk, it's it? August, aren't we? Yeah, it's cold already. Yeah, we're right at the top of um, Devil's Dyke, isn't it? Uh, basically, the yeah. yeah, the Dansman Walk, basically. Uh, what used to be the Dyke Railway. Uh, I did this the other day, but, but from the bottom end. So I bought some uh, backup with me this time because <laughs> it was a very creepy place uh, we're going to film it from the top walking downwards and uh, see what we can capture on camera what do you reckon yeah see what we can come up with yeah, yeah i'm recording in ghost tube guys so uh words should come through there as well and i've got my em uh, my k2 meter and peter's got a light did you want to film as well or? um if necessary. Yeah, right. so well, I got, I got the I've got it in my pocket anyway. So no we'll problem. flip you around guys and here we go. Right. Can't see much in front at the moment, so if I put this light on. There we go. Not sure how long this will last. <laughs> yeah. So was this the actual railway path, or was it further down? Uh, I don't think this is the, anything the railway path, but under the map, it's a very confusing map because there's lots like forever. Yeah, it looks like very open land, so maybe this was a turning point. We will be going to a very original part, which that lower light you can see straight ahead. That is where it used to stop off to go up to. The Devil's Dyke. Yeah. yeah. Which we will be doing at some point, guys, before it gets too cold. We're going to be doing the Devil's Dyke. Well, I think we've got a couple of camps down to our right. Oh, okay. That could be where the torchlight was coming from. I don't know what they're doing down there. So, if there are any souls within this area that would like to communicate, my name is Paul, that's Pete. I'm recording with a device that should be able to pick you up if you speak. That was deceiving. What is that? It's a tractor. There's no one there at all, so I'm oh, okay. already. That's a tractor. Uh, any rust grandson grandson oh here come the bugs again Pete look yeah any rustling you hear guys is uh, probably my jacket uh, let's try and get this to focus not too much light around here guys so we'll have to rough it really. Pete's got the torch. What way are we going Pete? Down? To our left please. Is that yeah, a fence? What's that a fence there to go through? That leads you into a nice big open field. Oh, does it? Yeah. Got a sign there that's pretty unreadable. <laughs> cycle trail. Oh, I see. Yeah, cycle trail, guys. Right next to a field. Golf course right next to it. And this is part of the original train line. I wonder if we'll come across any tracks. There are some behind us, I believe, beyond that little tractor thing. If you want to go walking in for a few. Well, this bench hasn't been used in a few years. A 
that's the sad thing about these places, isn't it? They sort of get forgotten. So who said grandson? Very quiet, isn't it? So an actual train line came up here. I believe it was only the, the one up and down route. Yes, which was, I reckon, that big area up top was probably a turnaround point. Yeah, look at this. I wouldn't like to fall down there. Seems very gritty, doesn't it, along here? Yeah, I must say, it's not, it hasn't changed for a long time, I think. Ever since I was ripping up here, a uh, 12 year old in a motorboat. <laughs> Laughing. Hasn't changed. Never know, we may hear a train. This must have been a lot wider at some point. If there was a, uh, a track up here. You know, there's not much to it on each side. That's why it's only about like 14 foot. Mansion. Mansion. Was there a mansion up here at some point? Could be, you know. You never know. You're talking what, hundred years ago? At least more, if anything. When was it discontinued? It was there. Uh, I did put it up before. I can't remember the date. I'll put it in the uh, description, guys. But ever since I was here, the mansion. Mention again. What happened to the mention? You keep hearing whispers, I do. This one again. Stop for a minute. Hmm. Always seems to go quiet when we stop, don't it? How long is this pathway? Mm. So I only walked about five minutes up from where I did it the other day. Mm, this is about the same length, but then you've got a good ten minutes on top of it till you get to the bridge. 
Let's see if we go as far as the bridge. So the train actually went over the bridge? No, no, no. Two Paraguay bridge. You know that? Yeah. Yeah. Just take you a good 10, 15 minutes to get down to that bridge. There's up at the dike, but there's no bridge there, only the, uh, the concrete slabs. We need to bring up a picture to show people that one. See what we think, how we see it. So the train used to come through here? It actually feels like someone's going to run up to you, doesn't it? I'm going to put the uh, K2 meter on, guys. Probably won't flash tonight because I've got someone with me. I can always hold back. No, it only seems to do it when I'm on my own. No. It's weird, isn't it? Although it did flash with uh, Teresa when we was in Pembury. Very calm. Oh, here we go. No, it stopped again. Back up. Oh. Oh, poor snail. <laughs> Sorry, snail. Flashed right up to the orange and then went back down again. You know, I feel surrounded, don't you? Is there any souls? Gone. Gone? What, the railway's gone? Yeah, I know. It's very sad. I would have liked to have travelled on it. Do you miss it? Right guys, I'm going to put you on the stand, put you on the floor. Just face you forward. Anybody here? Do you visit here? Hello, Pete. Are you trapped here? Does this train still run in the spirit world? Or are you trapped in the time when it was running?
can talk through that device that I'm recording with where the light is. My name is Paul. That's Peter. I'd like to speak your name. Don't be scared. Come forward, come on. Oh, I've gone really cold. Am I dead? Uh, yes, you are. You're, you're a spirit. Are you stuck in this area? Are you visiting? and talk to us. What Year are we? 2021. What are we standing on? We're on the old railway. speak yeah, we'll try a bit further down oh, no. Not more. Good light, bugs. yeah so it came through, am I dead? So did you die because of the rail? Because of the train? Did you not know you died? Was you murdered by somebody? Yeah, I went freezing cold there when I was standing there. From behind. Hmm. Right, we'll walk to that area where you said the bridge, and then well, that's quite a distance from there, right? Oh, is it? Yeah, that, the, the actual bridge, the old bridge, is probably the worst thing to try and find in the dark when it's up near the pub. Oh, is it? Yeah, this bridge is ours, meaning the bridge that cuts across your carriageway. Oh, okay. Where you would walk up to. Yeah, from down that end. Oh, okay. So I might have to do that then one night. If you was to carry on a little bit more to the end of the flats, you'll get to that bridge. Yeah. But from here, it's a, it's a hike. Lovely and nice weather. Well, this is the second time that I've done 
this area, mm -hmm. well, first time from this end, yeah. it feels like I'm drawn here as if, as if they want me to come here. Or well, someone wants me to come here, you know. Yeah. They want to give a message out or something. And hopefully no one's had misfortune here. Well, who's to say? I mean, it could be hundreds of years someone might have died here. You know what it was like in the old days, you know? This, this had three platforms, two platforms on the way up from, from this truck. I don't know what happened there, if anything. I keep hearing like a muffled, a muffled whisper. I'm not sure if that's wind or my coat. <laughs> Now, did you hear that? It was like a, it was in the wind. It sounded like you heard me. Let us hear you again. Oh, crap. another snail. Sorry, snail. <coughs> I think I just kicked that one. I didn't tread on it. Well, this K2's not flashed at all. It did flash though, didn't it, when I settled down? No, I'll give you a little bit of distance again. <laughs> well, I don't tread on any more snails. You see that, guys? I mean, look, the K2's now started flashing again since Pete went, stayed back. So I think I'm right what I said, Pete. I think they tend to come near you when you're on your own. Yeah. So I think... No, I think maybe you should do some videos on your own. See what you get. Now let me know in the comments, guys, if you want Pete to do some alone stuff. <laughs> I've been trying to for months. Oh, he's left me all the way up there, look. <laughs> so, if there are any souls here that would like to communicate, now's the time, because Pete is quite a distance behind me. Yeah, you can flicker with my light if you want. Do it again. Come and soul, speak to me. Talk through this device I'm recording with. It's running an app called Ghost Tube. It's a word dictionary. Oh, guys, the K2 is flashing. But every time I move it to the front of the camera, it stops. So going up to yellow, like a steady blink. Oh, went to orange there. Something here. Someone here. Let's turn this light right off. Far away. Who's far away? Are you lost? Yeah, I'm actually moving the camera around, guys. <laughs> That's how dark it is. Uh, 
can see nothing now. Strange one. Right. Shall we turn around and walk back, Pete? I can see lights up ahead. What's that? Oh, okay. So it's quite a walk to that point. Yeah, it looks a bit far. It's a good exercise. Not for these smells. No, no, poor things. <laughs> Just trying to get from one end to the other, aren't they? Right, so anyway, guys, we're not sure what we've got on camera. We may have EVPs. So always wear your headphones because I'm quite sure I've heard a few on the wind. I think that's how they communicate with sounds from the air. That's why they tend to talk over your voice as well. I think that's wind, isn't it? No. No. Maybe there's something we didn't didn't hear. No what? You don't want to be filmed? K2 just flashed again. This is super creepy along here, isn't it? Oh, K2 meters going. Oh. It always stops when I go to move it to the camera. <laughs> See it? It keeps flickering, doesn't it? Yeah. Are you trying? Trying to use this energy? I reckon they're just beginning to notice us. That's why they're, they're probably just turning up now. I will use my energy. If you want. Wow, that red lined. Sorry? That went right up to the red then. No. You like that idea of using my energy? Come on, use some more. Pete's just there. You want to say anything to him? Use my energy. I'm full up with after eight, so I'm good. <laughs> Oh on guys, oh, this makes my hand ache, this does hold in it for too long, I should get one that connects to the head, the body, yeah, body cam, yeah, strap on, <laughs> Did someone just say my name then? It sounded like... Oh. Cigar. Cigar? Nun. A nun? There's a nun? There's a nun smoking a cigar. <laughs> Wasn't there a cigar called um Blue Nun? Yeah, Blue no, that's Nun. A drink. Oh no, it's a drink, yeah. <laughs> oh is there? That possibly is. That's Guys, if there's any brands of cigars that are called Nun, let me know in the comments. Could have been one in the old days, you know, the uh, old style ones. That's why I just saw a light shoot up there. There was a shooting star. I'm catching something with my light. <laughs> Oops. 
the, al the aliens are coming. <laughs> so quiet, isn't it? Always wear your headphones, guys, because you never know. Many a times, because I've got 5.1 surround sound, so... I just... No. No, again. What are you saying? You don't want to be heard? What are you saying no to? Answer me. Well, I might as well turn this K2 off. It's not flashing. Put it in my pocket. Hey? Put your battery. Maybe they was using my energy. What is that smell, Pete? It smells, um. Not so dark. No, like diesel y. You smell that? Was it a diesel train? No, steam, wasn't it? I think it was steam. It may have ended up on a diesel. Depends how big they made them. Well, small. I don't think this was a big train. Possibly. Well, it started off as a passenger uh, train, didn't it? And then it wasn't busy enough, so it uh, changed it to cargo, wasn't it? Or was it the other way around? I mean, it was first used for farming. Yeah, cargo, wasn't it? Yeah, so it was the other way around. And it started off with cargo, and then it became a passenger train. And then because there wasn't enough numbers travelling, they stopped it, wasn't it? Then they built a pub on top of the hill, and mm. be nice to have that train ride now. Yeah, it was, yeah. Especially through all this countryside. That's what's happening to all their heritage, isn't it? All their history, it's all disappearing. Guys, I know this is a quiet video, but I just want to see if I get EVPs, whispers. And if that's the case, then we will be coming back with more stuff, more gear to use. A couple of chairs. Yeah, and we'll sit and have a proper chat and investigation. I just wanted to see if this area is still alive. Is that the right word? Alive? Yeah, yeah. Be Active, lot. yeah. One end could be a lot more than the other. Maybe you could have been starting at the right end. Yeah. Well, like I said, it felt really creepy down that end. Oh, it definitely is. There's a whole different feeling when you're on your own. Mm -hmm. You actually feel like, you know, you've got things around you. Makes them a lot more alert. That's one good thing. Yeah. It all depends where you are. This ghost tube is very, very quiet. Apart from saying no a few times. Maybe they didn't want to be recorded. Am I right? 
My back is freezing. Is your, is your back freezing? My neck is. That could be missed, I can't see. That's why I don't do a lot of the talking. Who knows? Is there someone following? Answer me. Respond, please. Oh, I'm sorry, but they're being too quiet for a reason. Are you holding secrets? About what really happened here? Why it was shut down? Drowned. Drowned. Huh? Yeah. Who who drowned? The owner of the railway? Was you murdered? Okay, we're, we're going to leave now. Strange one, God. Can you hear that? There are animals down there, is there? If they were, they'd pick that spot right very randomly, yeah? Sounded like a pig, didn't it? Almost. Squealing. Yeah. I don't think there is any other one, yeah. But there is a farm not close, uh, not far away from here. It's right in front of us. I don't think there's anything there. I don't know, like this screen keeps glitching big time. Souls, before I leave, tell me something about the Dyke Railway. Was it a fun ride? Did you use it for commuting to and from work? Did you work on the farmland? Did you travel during the war? Yeah, it was also used for um, moving materials around in the wartime. So you don't require prayer then? If you don't speak to me I won't say one. I know it sounds like blackmail but it's not. Just if I don't hear from you then I would assume that you're happy, you're content. You know my name is Paul, don't you? And that's Peter behind me. So give us your name, at least.
I don't know how it's so quiet. It's really strange. Are you being prevented from talking? Is someone stopping you? Bloody bugs. <laughs> so annoying. Okay guys, well, not really sure what to say about this one. If you want a creepy walk video, then I suggest watching. <laughs> but you never know, I may have got EVP, so. Yeah, we must have come into the end, of the gravelly, ain't it, on the floor again. So, the Dyke Railway can't have been all that impressive if you haven't got much to say about it. Was it just a workhorse? Did you not hear that? What? Something behind? Something just ran along there. Ran? Ran. You can hear it. You can hear it because you're thinking you're you talking. Yeah. That was galloped. Like a horse. It shouldn't be any happy. Could have been a deer. does feel like we're being watched though, don't it? Yeah, feel something's lunged. Okay, that was that, a deer. Quite an empty space over the back there. That could have been the railway back there, there's a big gap. There could possibly be another... That's another track. Part up that end, isn't it? It's hard to find that right layout, there's too many of them. Not the right one. That could be my saying no, they were in the wrong area. You might have been in the right one down there. Because if you look, if you look back there, I'll lift the camera up. Looks like there's a, a gap or something in between the bushes. Is that where the railway was? Am I pointing the camera to the right place? Yeah, tough one guys, tough one. Or possibly this could have been a station. Big enough for a spot, isn't it? Yeah. Easy if you look, if you can see, got a chunky bit of space there. Yeah. Souls was that a station? Not saying anything, are they? Yeah. Very stubborn. But then again, that bench is pointing the th the wrong way as well. <laughs> yeah. Great view for a bush. You know, maybe the maybe the station was that way or something. And the train come in. You never know. Anyway guys, let's flip you around and uh, Pete will have to light us up so we can end this video.
Yeah, so anyway, interesting place, guys. Let's light us up. Oh, there we go. We look scary, don't we? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching, guys. Hopefully, we picked up some stuff on camera. Uh, Peter says good night. And we'll see you in the next video, guys, which will be Tuesday with me and Pete, and possibly Monday with me. Do a 10, 10 15 minute one. Keep them anyway, running. Yeah. Keep those bad boys running. Be safe, guys. See you soon.